Hey guys, Jaysha. Today, I'm going to change my PC case from this to this. The case that I'm replacing is a mid-tower thermatic case with a huge window side panel. And this case features USB 3.0, 7 expansion slot and a side mounted GPU slot but it will slightly decrease your cooling for your GPU. So you have your new case and you need to move all your components from your old case to your new case. You can start removing whatever you want from a case since there are no proper way to remove it. All the thing you need is only a Philips screwdriver and that's all. I started to remove the graphic card from my case since it is the largest in the case. And try to put all your components on an anti-static surface to prevent any charge to damage your component. Next will be the hard drive. All you need is unscrew 4 screw from a hard drive and you do so. Next, you can unplug all the power connector from your motherboard and remove the power supply. And we can start to remove all the cable, include your case cable, fan cable, SATA cable, and your motherboard cable. At this point, you can start to remove your motherboard from your old case since we are using the same component in a new case, so we no need to remove the RAM, heatsink, and the CPU. Then you can start to put all your components back into a new case. And you need to remove all the side panels to provide you more easy access. Many people forgot to put in their real I.O. shoe first before they put in their motherboard, so note that down. After the I.O. shoe install, you can put back your motherboard into a new case. The screw location is depend on your motherboard size, whether it's ATX or MATX. I will spend more time on the cable management since I have a large window side panel. And the hard drive, all you need is just slide into the bracket and that's all. And now you can put all the cable back into your component. And the last thing is the graphics card. It's very easy to put in, you just slide into the slot and make sure the clip is in place. Since I have a large window side panel, I will install this LED strip and you can get it from eBay or Amazon for cheap. Put back all the side panel and we are done. This is the end of the video and I hope you like it. Peace out.